everyone welcome to njps online classes hope we will have a happy learning session and one more thing if you like the content please do subscribe today children we are going to learn about railway station who doesn't like to sit in a train and travel to various places so let's learn about railway station children first we will know about different types of train the first type of train is the goods train goods train is used to move different kinds of goods from one place to another the second train is the passenger train we use passenger train to travel to different cities and villages the third type of train is the metro train children metro is used to travel within city to travel within short distances metro train is used another train which is used and is the local train local train is also used like metro train to travel within city and the last one is the tram the tram is a train where you travel within city but at shorter distances but at shorter distances here you need not go to a particular railway station to get into a tram you move in the city itself with the help of a tram children now let us suppose we are traveling from one city to another now when we reach the railway station the first person we see is a luggage carrier or a coolie can you see over here a person dressed in red coat who is ready to carry our luggage from one place to another that person is known as a coolie or a luggage carrier next children we then go to the ticket counter we go to the ticket counter and we either book the tickets for a specific train or we buy the platform ticket then children once we book our tickets then we enter the railway station and we check the electronic display board can you see over here there is a display board where train numbers train names then the timing of the trains as well as the platform number is mentioned yes we check our train is coming on which platform number and then we start moving towards the platform before we get inside the platform children what happens our luggages are checked at the luggage counter the luggage counter is where we check our luggages children after we get our luggage check we then move inside the platform platform is the place where a train halts or stops okay can you see over here children the red circles this is the platform number at a railway station there are many platforms and each platform is given a specific number like 1 2 3 etc children if we want to move from one platform to another we can use the escalator can you see over here the circled escalator yes we use the escalator to move from one platform to another children we also have a waiting room at the railway station what does waiting room help us with waiting room helps us to wait for our train children if the train is delayed for certain time we need to rest somewhere that is the waiting room which we used to rest children there is also a clock room available at the railway station and what does it help us with it helps us to keep our luggage safely if we want to go somewhere else okay if we want to go somewhere else for supposedly half an hour and we don't know where to keep our luggage safely 
then we can always go to the clock room and deposit our luggage over there for some time children then we also have a cafeteria at the railway station when we are hungry we want to eat something or get some food packed for us to eat in the train cafeteria is the place we go to get the food children we also have book stores at railway station we want to buy magazines read some books we can always go to a book store and get it children do you know who rides a train who drives a train yes the engine driver rides a train now children the engine driver gets signals to start the train and to stop the train or to slow the train these signals are shown by the train signal can you see over here just like the traffic signal we also have train signal the engine driver looks at these signals and decides whether to stop the train or to move the train slowly or to go ahead then children there is also railway guards who show flags to engine drivers to move the train or stop the train can you see over here the guard is showing the green flag that means the train has to move and if the guard shows red flag then the train has to stop also children there is the traveling ticket examiner in the train the ticket examiner checks whether we are carrying the valid ticket to travel in the train cab and whether we are seated in the right seat traveling ticket examiner or tt thank you hope you all enjoyed the video please do subscribe our channel